they need to survive. <laughs> right. So earlier you mentioned like all these different uh, cultures, yeah. and it sounded like it was African culture, like Somali, uh, Caribbean, Ghanaian, Ghanaian, Congolese, Congolese uh, yeah, um, all in everyone. So like. I imagine that's what sparked your like interest in the, the African diaspora. No, it was just being Rastafari. That's what we really? did. That's so what that's we what learned. Was. Okay. Yeah, my uh, alphabet was A is for Africa. <laughs> oh wow! And Harriet Tubman at the bottom and other people. No, but that's history. really dope though, because <laughs> the fact that you're learning that at home and then you're around these different people, yeah. like, and we learned Ari in school and everything, and so we learned about you know like um, Diwali and all these different types of you know Hanukkahs and yeah. So we get educated on all that stuff. It's just still no, not it. good. That's the thing. Do you know what's awkward? So it may be better in that sense from America, but it's not the best because it's still colonized version in a British way because it's still, remember you guys have an independence from Great Britain. So it's still <laughs> a colonizer version of yeah, um, what things are. So then it's good that I learn my rest away because then I'm learning the Pan-Africanism. So that's what yeah, I'm learning, learning the real truth whilst also learning what the British think about us and how they're telling us their story. And I'm able to see it as a whole from the victors who were able to tell the story and the people that told the stories through word of mouth, which is really cool. Right. See, but that's that's so... To me, I appreciate that because like they're not teaching us this shit. Like, they don't teach us half of anything outside. If it ain't got nothing to do with the United States of yeah. America, they're not teaching us about it. If it ain't got nothing to do with making them look good, they're not going to teach us about it. Like, I had to, like, go to books. I had to go to scholars. Yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? I had to, I had outside of school to learn these things, Pan-Africanism, even being familiar with that term. I wasn't until in my 20s. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot hidden from you, and I'm not going to lie. Even when I, because um, I also look into a lot of um, American culture a lot. Um, and so even when it comes to your Pan African um, learning, it's inaccurate as well. See? A lot. Like, uh, there's too many people saying that Nubian queen and all this stuff, you're not from that. That doesn't make any sense. Like, you know, everyone isn't a Nubian queen because you're black. Like, that's not right. how it works. Like, that's a specific place in Africa do you get what I'm saying like mm -hmm. um so it's just kind of like some things are just a bit inaccurate and I feel like conspiracy theories mesh too much to fit agendas and it doesn't need to be told that way the stories how they are 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 enough things don't need to be warped and things don't need to be rewritten more tragically because it's already tragic and there's also like crazy victory stories and stories of us oppressing and us colonizing which is mm. sick <laughs> you know there's so much like going on like the moors and shit like right. <laughs> there's so much and then even the just small things within the bits of the world like to be honest the best thing you can do is leave travel yeah. that's what you do like realistically before i'm leaving to come to america like we all know america has its whatever so does the uk so we're in these countries the western countries that are just ugh. but at the same time it's like i'd rather go to to america and go like an explorer like i'm traveling and get to know people for who they are as human beings and you know some people are going to be assholes like everywhere and so, some people are going to be amazing and you're going to connect with people and that's an example of that person you know right. <laughs> you know <laughs> like it's kind of like i don't want to generalize people at all i i travel a lot and i like to just yeah you do yeah i just the prefer... world you travel the world 